Jobs Fish and uh, Connection Pools for Java DB to run uh, database one example. Uh, database one example an index.html shows that uh, customer bin is a Java bin and the calls get all method and then for each customer from this collection we display uh, a first column customer ID second column name and so on uh, to have this uh, Java bin is declared uh, this way uh, get all met method uh, make connections to the Java database and execute the select all command uh, from customer database uh, and then result set is uh, con uh, modified uh, and processed such that it is populated into CRS which is cached row set and this cached row set uh, works with uh, JSF uh, such that uh, each element in this collection is treated uh, as a, a Java object and the instance fields a uh, property name is the same as uh, a database table so database table which this program connects to is a sample database uh, so if I connect it it shows that one of the table is customer and that customer has those uh, as a uh, uh, record fields uh, and those names in the database table is recognized as a uh, uh, instance field a property of a uh, java bean and uh, which is uh, through processing of a result set is uh, processed into cache the row set to make this work uh, in a Java bean, what it says is uh, this line, a resource. So this is called the resource injection. So for this uh, instance field, the DS, uh, it is initialized through resource injection. And this resource injection is a uh, uh, Java DB database connection with the connection pools. Uh, the name of the connection is JDBC slash sample2. So we need to configure this one so that this pro program works. Uh, so this is how to configure. So this is the project for this sample example. So first uh, to configure the glass fishy, we need to press the plus button there and then choose a category of uh, Glass fish and then choose a JDBC resource. Then we create new JDBC connection pool and then JNDI name. This is the resource injection part. Sample 2 is the name I used in the Java Bean program. So next, and we don't need any additional property. So next, and then you need to give a name of the connection pool. So let's name it sample pool 2 and then uh, we extract it from the sample connection which I just did uh. so using this one uh, glassfish creates connection pool for the sample database uh, and that that is recognized as a JDBC slash sample 2 is the name of that and then here resource type uh, should be changed to connection pool data source uh. Then next, and then here is uh, the information about uh, the uh, connection pool. So initially, there's eight connection is made, and the maximum thirty two, and so on. There's the details there. Choose all those default value. And done. Then you will find that uh, file glass of fish resources is created uh, out of that. And then if you go to the uh, glass of fish server. Uh, Glassfish server uh, under JDBC, you will find that if I refresh sample 2, refresh sample pool 2, those are created. Uh, and the one more step to run this program is uh, we need to uh, change configuration in uh, web XML. So as you unfold, unfold the configuration files, you have a web XML. Open it. 
and then you need to add a, a reference uh, to this one so click reference and then add a, what we are going to add the JDBC sample to the resource type is a connection pool but unfortunately we don't see connection pool data source there so anyway choose the default value create one and then go to the source XML file in source uh, we need to edit here connection pool as the correct value and then save it then all done so we have now configured the uh, uh, class efficient the Java DB so that this name is uh, recognized and then it is uh, represented by DS uh, through the injection mechanism so now DS is initialized you can get connection issue the SQL command and then close that then uh, the connection is returned to the pool for each connection call you get a connection from the pool and after you use that just to return it to the connection pool so uh, if I run this one, what you will see is uh, the, all the data from the customer table is displayed uh, using uh, JSF. So this is uh, uh, how to set up a class of fish and uh, a connection pool to run this sample demo.